Now I'd like to take you into the new Fleet Complete Vision Module built right into FC Hub. So the new Vision Module is our state-of-the-art AI-based machine learning video telematic solution. As you'll see in another video, the hardware, the advanced hardware itself and a drive. Uh, but on this part, I'm gonna show you the software overview of how a fleet manager would manage their fleet using the Vision solution. So first off, I'll take you into the rules setting. Our Vision product is completely customizable. So as a fleet, you can specify what things you care about capturing video events on and what events you wanna coach the driver on while they're driving. So for example, I, uh, if I'm using the dual facing camera, I could choose to turn the dual facing, uh, driver facing uh, on or off. I could specify what language uh, English, French, or Spanish, I want the camera to speak to the driver in and at what volume. I can monitor speeding and define what does speeding mean. So the camera can read speed limit signs and based on the speeding threshold you've set, for example, could be six miles over or 10 miles over uh, to define what a speeding violation is. And if you check audible alerts, the camera will speak to the driver if they cross that threshold. So it's kind of like a Siri or Alexa sounding voice. So if I'm speeding along a 50 uh, uh, speed zone and I'm going over the threshold here, the camera will speak to me as the driver saying speeding violation detected. Uh, the dash cam can also monitor harsh acceleration, harsh braking, harsh cornering, rolling stops, tailgating, lane drifting, distracted driving, and fatigue driving. And again, every one of these can be turned on or off and the audible coaching, live coaching can be turned on or off. And many of these settings can be made more sensitive or less sensitive based on the thresholds that you've set here. We also have the ability to give the driver some warning rules such as tailgating as a warning versus as a violation. Uh, we can also announce the, the speed limits that the vision camera picks up to the driver. So if they're driving along a 50 zone, the camera will say speed limit 50. As a safety tool to just remind the driver of what speed limit zone that they're driving in at the moment. We can announce stop signs again as a safety reminder and we can turn all of these on or off. So if you have stop sign on, it will simply tell the driver stop sign. Again, just as a verbal reminder and school zones. Um, you can customize these settings based on different sort of uh, vehicle duty types like light duty, medium duty, and heavy duty because oftentimes these vehicles have different thresholds of harsh braking and rapid acceleration so you can tailor it based on vehicle duty type. Okay, once I've configured my system, the, the vision module starts to give me insights in the vision dashboard. So for example, it shows me here in the vision dashboard and I'm simply running it for my whole fleet for the last seven days, the number of events that it's capturing on average per day, um, the number of um, uh, what's the most common event or the least common event. And then here it shows me a, a graph of the average number of events per day uh, per 100 miles. Uh, I also get to see here my highest risk drivers and my lowest risk drivers, making it really easy for me to start to dig into where do I need to focus from a risk and safety perspective, who do I really need to work on from a coaching perspective, and who may, do I, may, may I want to reward with some sort of incentive or reward program. So our dashboard makes it really easy for you to orchestrate your own incentive program in your fleet based on how you've set up the vision parameters. So you, for example, you could say your top X drivers get a weekly reward with a gift card or um, your drivers that meet a certain threshold of uh, below being certain number of events per 100 miles get some sort of bonus or something like that. So vision makes it really easy to incentivize your fleet to operate more safely. Let's jump in now and look at some of the actual videos that the vision solution uh, comes up with. So I'm just gonna pull up uh, one of our, our people here that I'd like to show you one of their trips. So Jeff had a trip on December 16th. Um, the trip was at 6, 10 p.m. Here we have a, a legend of the trip showing that the trip was from 6, 10 p.m. to 6, 38. Uh, 15 mile trip, 28 minute trip. There were three speeding events, 
14 tailgating events, one rolling stop, one harsh acceleration, one lane drift, and one distracted driving. Let's go check, uh, check out the distracted driving event as an example, something that we really want to monitor as a fleet to make sure that our drivers are, are not distracted driving. So I clicked on that event, and quickly you can see the event is pulled up, the video is rolling, and you see Jeff here is looking at his cell phone while he's driving going, uh, I'll just play this back again. He's going 32, 33 miles on a two lane road. Not a safe thing to do, frankly. So the video correctly captured a distracted driving event. It would have announced that it captured that event to Jeff in the cab. So it would have said distracted driving detected. And now here I have the video um, to see it as a fleet manager. And I see all the videos of that trip listed here on the right and I can scroll through them and look at different sort of videos, for example, Here's a rolling stop, so the camera picked up the stop sign. And if Jeff didn't stop fully as I specified, which he didn't there, he just kind of rolled through that stop sign, it marked that event as a rolling stop event. And the camera would have announced to Jeff, rolling stop detected. If as a fleet manager, I want to really coach Jeff on these events, I can flag these events. Uh, so I would just click this flag here and perhaps I'll select that distracted driving event as well. I'll flag that one. And now it puts it into my recordings section of Fleet Complete, which is I kind of think of as a coaching console. So when I go into recordings now, if I've called in Jeff as an example uh, into the office for a coaching ses session, those two events that I flagged are right there uh, in this screen for me so I can simply um, you know, sit down and have a safety meeting and coach Jeff on you know, what they could do better next time around. And after I've finished coaching Jeff on that event, I could simply mark the event as coached. And the, this allows me to, uh, or enables me to easily track what events I really want to focus on coaching my fleet drivers on to help make them safer. So really simple, but yet very advanced vision module that allows you to really customize the kind of way that you want the system to work to coach your drivers to maximize their safety.